ticket. Thanks, Dad. Can you leave it in your chin? Thank you, Dad. Did you go see the job man to do that? Aye, son, I did. He says, he'll ask me to work for £6.73 an hour. Could you not go back to the army, Dad? No, son, I'm too fat. Too old. I've got a bit of metal in my head. So you've got a metal brain? Well, some people might think I've got a metal brain, but... No, I've just got a wee tiny bit of metal in my head. Uh, what happened? Twelve years ago, in a place called Bagram. And I was in the back of an armoured vehicle. It's actually called a wolfhound. Loads of plates on it and a big gun on the top, a big GPMG machine gun and a 50 caliber big massive bum 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 gun. So anyway, we're in this, we're in this wolfhound, we're driving up the road, all of a sudden, wee boy walks out. Oh he slammed the brakes on thinking, oh no, we're going to run this wee guy over. But it turns out, as soon as we stopped, he turns around and he looks to his left and his right. He dives into a doorway. Just as he dives into a doorway, BOOM! <laughs> this lunatic leans out a window with a rocket propelled grenade. You know, one of these big things that go. Is that a firework? It's like a big giant firework, and he's like, whack! Right in the back of the wolfhound. So the door bursts open, and a wee pal, Jenky McGinty, he falls out the back. <laughs> he does a backflip, right? <laughs> <laughs> and he takes his gun and it basically whaps him right in the forehead. <laughs> <laughs> That's a bit funny. <laughs> no offence. So it just whaps him right in the forehead, right? So, I'll get a bottle of water and I get such a fright, I just crush it and I just get covered in water, right? <laughs> the guy next to me, a Welsh guy, Taff, I'll just call him Taff for Taff's sake, I don't actually know his name, but I never really spoke to the guy. He lets out an almighty fart right next to me in the cabin. <laughs> Just like that. <laughs> <laughs> right. Yeah. Right, calm down. That's so heavy. Right, listen. So I open the front door and I run round the back to grab Jinky. I grab him. Lo and behold, the same wee boy walks out an alleyway, walks out of the stairwell, picks up a 9 mil pistol. Shoots me. So what happened? I was really, really, really lucky. It turns out that the gun jammed and uh, the bullet never actually left the pistol. But there was another guy in the window, the guy that fired the big whooshah, and he fired as well. But it clipped the back of my helmet, it was like a big slap in the back of my head, and a bit of metal went whack! Right in there, see the mark? You see that? Aye. And uh, I don't know, I think it hit a nerve or something and then I, I remember I blacked out. I went to sleep and I was unconscious for about... After that when you woke up? I had a big bandage I made and I remember I looked like, I don't know, like the mummy. Only I was the daddy, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> And then, obviously, I get back to my unit, and then I had to go to physio, I had to go and get checkups, and then that's why I was away for so long, and then, so and then you only do at the time. boy been now, so like, the actual age of him right now. So you're what, you're 10? Yeah. <coughs> I ain't the wee boy when I mean, I ain't the wee boy who'd have been about the same age as you are now. Exactly it, you just went to all these places, that then you came back, and that was your sorted again. No, that's how I will work. I kind of, it's not like I don't want to work, thank you, it's not as if I, I don't want to work, it's just that my doctor will not let me go to work because uh, sometimes I take blackouts, you know what I mean, I just switch off like, so that's why I don't work, it's not that I don't want to work, I, mean, you know? I know that all your pals have got money and everything, and, you know, but I, I, I kind of do that for you. I understand in that. So, so what 
So really it's like you can't get a job. So say we, we can only like use the bank in that. Uh, that's right, basically the money goes into the bank once a fortnight. Well, if that's what you can call it, money. <laughs> hey, at least you get enough for chips. And a burger. And a burger. You finished them, you've polished right, them. Right, right. <laughs> oh, man, eh? <laughs> yeah, sorry about you, but we're getting there, wouldn't it? <laughs> oh.